Hello guys, as you can see, I'm still uh, dressing my summer vacation because we are going to talk about simple past, okay? At this time, you are going to talk about simple past questions. So, take a look here in my blackboard. I have two questions. So, question number one, did you go to Rio on your last vacation, okay? So, as you can see here, I have a question, all right? Then, to ask a question in the simple past, we are going to use the particle did. So, I have a did, the subject, okay? And the verb. As you can see, the verb here, it is the in the original form, okay? So, once I use did, I already indicate that we have a simple past and the verb goes back to the original form. In the second question, uh, where did you go in your last vacation? So here I have a WH question, okay, did, and the verb goes back to the original form. So once I put did, to indicate past, okay, the verb goes back to the original form. So, let's go to your workbook on page 61. So, I have here page 61. Let's work with exercise uh, number one in the grammar section. Simple past questions. So, number one, put the words in the order to make a question. Check your answers in the article on page 60. So, here I have one, two, three prompts, okay? Prompts with question. Pause your video and uh, try to put these prompts in questions, okay? Transform these prompts in question. So, let's check together. So, oh, I like this. I'm going to put a little bit higher. So, here I have the prompt. Uh, once here I have what? A WH question. I'm going to put what? What did you do? Then, uh, I have how did you meet and number three did uh, did you take a friend to the show. So let's check. As you can see, I have the particle did, okay, and the verb goes back to the original form. Let's check now exercise number two. On number two, I have complete the table. So I have the particle in the short answer. So, if I have a question, I'm going to use did. So, did you enjoy the show? Okay, so for all the persons, we are going to use did. Or, uh, the second one, number two here, what time did you get home? I have a WH question after I'm going to put it did. So, did you enjoy the show? What time did you get home? Then for the short answer, we are going to use yes, I did or no, I didn't for all persons. For example, yes, uh, I did or no, she didn't. All right? Or uh, I didn't get home at midnight. 
I didn't get home at midnight. Let's see this uh, in the answer page. So here I'm going to put did. Then what time did you, he, she, we, they get home? And the short answers. Yes, did. No, didn't. And uh, didn't get. Ah, okay. They on this. Let me see what's wrong here. So on, on number five, okay, you only put the verb in the simple past form. Okay, this is affirmative. So you got home at midnight. So let's go back there. Okay, uh, let's see exercise number three. Match the questions and answers. So we have two columns we have one two three four and five and the answers pause your video read both columns okay then we come back here to check exercise number three so uh, let's check exercise number three i always like to start with the answers all right so it will be easier to check the questions so um, answer one this one yes I did I completed four levels so for this answer did you have a good weekend did you play computer games yesterday uh, where did you meet your best friend who did you text yesterday what did you have for dinner last night as number one, I have levels. I will put, did you play computer games yesterday? Yes, I did. I completed four levels. Next one. We met at school four years ago. So this one, where did you meet your best friend? We met at school four years ago. Then, who did you text? yesterday so when you have your cell phone like mine you can text somebody as a verb who did you text yesterday mm, i text my best friend then we had chicken and fries what did you have for dinner last night we had chicken and fries. And last one, no, I didn't. It rained all the time. Did you have a good weekend? No, I didn't. It rained all the time. So guys, as you can see, again, when you have questions in the simple past, we are going to use did, and the verb goes back to the original form. Did, verb in the original form. Did it's going to indicate the past, so it's not necessary to put the verb in the past again. Otherwise, it's going to be uh, two simple past in the same sentences, okay? But also, when you answer in the simple past, you have to put the verb in the simple past, okay? Texted, okay? Or met, or completed all right so i hope you have enjoyed this lesson see you next time bye bye